Hello, this is Rolf Agner, the trainer for SICK Incorporated. We're going to discuss the C4000 Select, the new light curtain family that we have. As you can see, the housings on these are quite rugged. They're very, uh, very strong. This is especially good for longer lengths, so you maintain some good rigidity and don't have as many alignment problems. Uh, Mounting-wise, we have three separate uh, channels for to mount to 8020 or any type of uh, structure that you have. Um, these are available in one foot increments, uh, one foot, two foot, up to six foot long, and the resolution is hand detection. I have 30 millimeter uh, uh, resolution on the light curtain so you can de uh, detect hands. Um, the other thing you'll notice, and let's put these down so you can see this well, um, it has a very nice, nice optional LED that's available on the receiver. And as we trigger this red and green, you can see how nice that changes color. And from across the plant, you can easily detect whether this light curtain is blocked uh, or there's or something wrong with it uh, by the color or, or if the status is okay with green. Don't have to lean in to look at the little LEDs uh, on, on the unit. One thing that's standard on this product is built-in laser alignment. And on the center, there's a push button. And if I were to push this button, it turns on the laser. And now if we zoom in a little closer to the receiver, you can see how how well this performs in aligning a product. If I take this out of alignment, you can see the laser shining down there now. You also will be able to see the LEDs come on as we get close to alignment. They first go yellow, and then when we get in real good alignment, we're going to get these to go green. You see how nice and green they are right now because we've got perfect alignment on this. And uh, that, that alignment works just terrific for getting this set up. You see on and off, on and off very well. Uh, the other thing that you'll see in the close-up here is uh, we have dip switch selection for some of the features of the light curtain. It has floating blanking as an option, one beam and two beam floating blanking. And that is configured by raising the lid here and then you can see the dip switches. Very simple to configure, one beam or two beam floating blanking. Other switches are used for beam coating. The beam coating is used if you have light curtains very close together sometimes a possibility of them cross-talking with each other and instead of having to purchase a separate part number to eliminate that problem we can just change the dip switch settings. There's also a setting for changing the range, short range or long range. Okay, So um, uh, another nice feature of this product is that it has a, a troubleshooting diagnostic, a seven segment display and I can illustrate how that works by well, making a change to a dip switch and you'll see immediately it comes on and you can look up a diagnostic code, and those diagnostic codes are listed right here, and they'll show you in detail what these numbers uh, represent, and, and not just what they say, but they'll give you a correction. And it says your dip switch change. Well, what, you, what happens if we make a dip switch change? We need to unpower and power up the unit again, and then that air would be clear. So C4000 Select, very uh, nice new light curtain series we have. Laser alignment built in as standard. The optional um, uh, uh, LED on top to make it very easy to uh, uh, see whether the, the status of the light curtain is all the way from across the plants. Thank you.